Hi hopefuls, welcome to the super secret second channel. Today we are unboxing a brand new, never been opened, still in the box Barbie dream house from 1985. I also think this might be the most expensive Barbie dream house that exists anywhere in the world right now. This thing costs $6,121. <laughs> but I think it's gonna be worth it because every single piece is still in here, untouched from the 80s. <laughs> I'm so excited. This might be one of my favorite Barbie dream house designs ever also. I just love the shape of it and all of the pink. Ah, it's gonna be so much fun. Look at how good of a condition this box is in, by the way. The front piece definitely looks the best. You can definitely see some of the age on these other sides. And then on the back here, we have this cute little diagram. <laughs> and in the fine print, it does say 1985. Look at these dolls too. And room after room of fun. All right, should we open this? This thing up. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Everything in here is still new in the original packaging. I'm so excited about this. I think this might be the only dream house in the whole video that actually comes with instructions. <laughs> Where was this two houses ago when we were struggling? <laughs> oh my goodness. That even has a pink roof. I already think this might be my favorite house in the whole video. Ooh, this is gonna be so satisfying. All of like the little dishes and stuff are still in their little frame to punch them all out individually. We've got brand new windows and doors with none of the notches broken. <gasps> Even the floors are pink. <gasps> a brand new bed with a brand new mattress. <laughs> it's like a memory foam mattress. What's all this? A piece of paper from 1985? Yeah, Mattel Toys Consumer Affairs, if we have any feedback. Oh my gosh, this is a little advertisement for all of the Barbies from that year. <gasps> Cute. We've got princess Barbies, rock star Barbies. <laughs> oh, look at the cute little sets. Beach Barbie, wedding Barbie. <gasps> oh my gosh, now I wanna go get all the Barbies. That Barbie Ferrari. <gasps> That's it, I'm doing a Barbie car video. <laughs> We've got a little friend in here from 1985. Would you like to meet him? Okay, here he comes. How long do you think he's been in that box? 40 years? What is that? We have a tiny sticker pack. I'm assuming that it's to go in the picture frames, probably an alarm clock, and then like a makeup kit. Whew. Okay, here we go. Okay, are we ready to open these packages that haven't been opened since almost 40 years ago? Wow. <laughs> Beautiful, untouched white plastic. Hasn't been yellowed by the sun yet. Time to put on our doors. Okay, window time. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Tyler, could we have pink lined windows in our next house? Whatever you want, Barbie. time we're gonna start with the living room the only way you can even tell that this stuff is really old is by looking at some of this paper <laughs> it's so discolored okay so these are our instructions on how to build the TV oh it's a pink TV it's exactly like some of the older houses but those ones were green snaps together <gasps> uh oh <laughs> there it is it's so cute okay and then we have a little pink fashion Barbie to put on the screen. The glue might be too old. I literally don't think it's gonna come off the paper. The sticker's been stuck for too long. See, look at it. The glue like aged. Oh no, <laughs> what are we doing? We can probably super glue it on. Nothing was ever wrong. <laughs> Ta-da. That's adorable. I think this also goes in the living room. I believe it is a sofa bed. A little couch that has a bed for, you know, when guests come over. This is such an interesting style of Barbie furniture. It just seems really like detailed, especially for the time. You can see like the woven pattern. Okay, that's for the guests. 
I mean, they really put some thought into this design, though. And it folds that way. Wow. Okay. End table. Haha. <laughs> okay. Wow. Cutest table. Okay. There is our complete living room. Amazing. Okay, this is one of the parts I'm the most excited about. We get to put plants in the planter. Step one is these little things. Step two, plants. So I pick whichever plant I want. And I take one of these little guys, pop that out, and then we decorate. Okay, done. I'm not gonna lie, my excitement about that part quickly turned to rage because that was tedious. <laughs> but it looks great. Okay, let's put it on the roof now. Only three more of those to go. Ah! Lost a nail. <laughs> All right, there are my lovely plants. Everybody in the Barbie neighborhood better compliment my plants for the things that I went through to plant those. <laughs> Okay, moving on to the middle section of the house. I'm gonna add these little lights by the front door. Cute. And I feel like these houses are very much a choose your own adventure as far as how you wanna place the furniture. And I think I'm gonna do the dining room table right when you walk in, you know, a statement piece. Oh my gosh. Is this the top of the table? Wait, that's so pretty. Oh no, it's a sticker though. Okay, I'm gonna put the little legs on first. Lost another nail. Okay, we've got two chairs. Cushion one, cushion two. Cute. Um, okay, we have a problem here though. A bunch of the dishes shattered in the box somehow. Yeah, like that's a piece of a cup. That's a piece of a cup. <gasps> that's so sad. Oh no. Um, I'll try to salvage what I can out of this. Okay, let's see if we have a sticker. Oh, well that one's a beautiful sticker still. How does that work? <laughs> oh man, I gotta line it up. Okay, I did pretty good. Wow, okay. Something about this really thin plastic that just couldn't handle being in a box this long. But that's okay. Nothing a little E6000 can't fix. <gasps> wow, this is like shattering. Maybe it is something A6000 can't fix. <laughs> I've purchased Barbie Dream Houses much older than this one. This is the first time this has happened or the plastic's just like shattering. I just got this off of eBay, so I have no idea the conditions that it was being stored in. Okay, well, there's my attempt at salvaging the candle. <laughs> it's a little lopsided. And then we put all of our little food in the trays here. Oh no, this is not gonna be a sticker anymore. I can feel it. <gasps> Wait, it's sticky. Wow, maybe I just peeled the other one weird or something. That one stuck pretty well. Okay, we've got our charcuterie board. And next, some assorted fruits. Okay, this is the fun plate. We've got bread and some sort of mystery meat and some deviled eggs. Nice. Okay, and then I think this little salad goes in the middle. Beautiful. Long stickers go on the sides of the table. I'm kind of confused if the parents are expected to do this or the kid, because this part of the job is not kid friendly. Okay, last thing on our sticker sheet is the center of these plates. Everybody gets a knife, but we're gonna have to battle it out for the spoons and forks. Only one fork stood the test of time. There it is. There's everything that's left of our 1985 dining table. <laughs> okay, and then up above is where I'm gonna put the little vanity. And if you saw my main channel video, you might recognize this. <laughs> Look how shiny and new it is. Okay, and then here's the little uh, stool. Put our little sticker on. I wonder at what year they decided to stop making us work for these things by twisting them out of here. Hair dryer. 
I'm gonna put these in the drawer. Hair dryer in the top drawer. That's gonna go up here. And then we've got all of these cute little hangers to put in the closet. Cute. Okay, time for the most exciting rooms. We've got the bedroom and the kitchen. Okay, I'm gonna start with the bedroom. I think the bedroom's gonna be pretty easy. We literally have the bed. Oh my goodness. I think this is exactly like the bed in the older versions. The foam is so nice and clean. <laughs> okay, memory foam mattress. Why does she have a cash register under her bed is what I'm wondering. It's like a computer. This is a computer? It looked like a 1985. I will tell you what it is. We were both wrong. It's a TV. I'm really confused how that's a TV. The screen is so little. It's like a radio TV. Weird. Okay, now we make the bed. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for these. It seems like the bedding in other dream houses is one of the first things to get lost, so this is so special that we have all of it. We've got reversible pillows. Wow. It's really like a whole set. We have the comforter and sheets and everything. Beautiful. Okay, we have a little pillowcase for the pillow. Okay, I do wish this was a fitted sheet for the bed. So how else am I supposed to do it? Just kind of like burrito the mattress up in it. Plop that on. Okay, that looks pretty good. Okay, we can go blue or flowers. I'm gonna go flowers. Is that right? Something seems weird here, but pillows, wow. Not bad. And then I'm gonna put this stuff in the bedroom. I'm not sure where it's supposed to go. Got a little tray, it can go on the end of the bed and we can put some tea for her. I thought these nails would be a cute idea for my Barbie videos and they're just so in the way. <laughs> Tea party for Barbie and her friends. We've also got the cute little phone and whatever that is and a diary. Wow, that is the world's smallest TV. Anybody that was around in 1985, let me know if tiny TVs like this were actually a thing. <laughs> okay, time to put the bed in the bedroom. Cute, and the TV. <laughs> Wow, I love it. Oh no, I have to do the rest of the plants. You know what, before we do the plants, I'm gonna do the kitchen. There's a lot of pieces here. Um, let's open up the stove first. Oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> you know, I'm starting to think the real reason that my parents never bought me a Barbie dream house was because they didn't want to put it together for me. <gasps> I've lost another nail. Wait, are there stickers for this? Control knobs. Okay, we've got some pieces missing to the stove, which have gotta be in the fridge. So we're opening it all. Oh my gosh, look how many of these there are. Oh wow, we got lots of stickers. Cute little dials. Gotta put our fridge shelves in. Okay, fridge complete. What I really want to know is why does Barbie drink so much? <laughs> Every dollhouse comes with so many drinks. All right, should I feel the fruit? Oh no, I have to put these stickers on all of this stuff. That's gonna take so long. <laughs> I feel like I need to take these nails off before I put these stickers on all this stuff. Cause that is tedious, tedious work. I will be back for this part of the job. In the meantime, let me at least store everything in here. Fridge, done. Stove and microwave, done. For now. <laughs> okay, let me speed through these plants and then I'll show you the finished house. Done. All right, pop these back on. And are you ready to see the completed dream house? Here it is. <laughs> Wait, I feel like we need to open it up though. So you can actually see the little rooms. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 
Man, this thing does not look like it took as much work as it did. It probably took four hours to set this up and I don't even have all the stickers on the food, but it's so cute. I genuinely think this is my favorite Barbie dream house ever. But if you wanna see every other Barbie dream house that's ever been made, make sure to go check out my main channel video because I bought them all. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe because my hands are literally bleeding from putting all of these together. And I'll see you in the next video.